Silicon has been used for decades in components that control high power electric current. In power electronics, transistors are responsible for rapidly turning current on and off to supply motors, converters, and industrial power systems. With every switching event, internal junctions are charged and discharged, and part of the energy is lost as heat. When the transistor conducts current, additional heat is generated by the internal electrical resistance of the material. As temperature rises, the atomic structure of silicon vibrates more intensely. Electrons move less efficiently, and electrical resistance increases. Above roughly 150 degrees Celsius, these effects accelerate, and electrical stability begins to decline. To withstand high voltages, silicon components are built with thicker internal layers, which increases size and raises energy losses. In applications in the range of tens of kilowatts, losses can reach several percent of total power, requiring large heat sinks and limiting switching speed. Materials such as silicon carbide have a more stable atomic structure and a wider forbidden energy band. These properties allow safe operation above 200 degrees Celsius, with lower losses and more compact components. Wide band gap materials enable power electronics to overcome the temperature, efficiency, and size limitations of conventional silicon.